Athos, Black Cross and Delmar back with Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. So in the last video we went through uh, Dwarf Woodlands, um, if this thing would cooperate with me now. It's a doing a cardi sweet. Yeah. We finished uh, Dwarf Dw uh, Woodlands, talked to Yang Sid at his place, and we're fixing to enter in what happened to have been before the disaster at Holabashin, Radiant Garden. You're gonna love how it looks. It's pretty different than what it was when it was Hollow Bastion. It was beautiful then, well, cleaner. Exactly. Hmm. I'm looking, I'm looking for something. Oh, that's actually pretty. Oh, a squish my duck. Yeah, you get to hear his voice actor now. Oh, Al Young's voice is in your suite. Yep. This can only mean Master Zeno was right. <laughs> He's still adorable yet terrifying. <laughs> Ready and fight! Oh, and by the way, I've learned some advanced spells. Oh, you level it up a little bit? Well, that and I've uh, been combining spells to help out a little bit. Let it go. Oh, here it goes. And I've been learning some new abilities to help out as well. Like, in in these later series, Daniel, you actually learn abilities like uh, HP up. HP up? Yeah. You know how I said that in later games you only earn HP through bosses? Yeah. Well, if your stats... Well, in the first game, you can level up to increase your HP. But in the second game, you only get them in bosses. Right. But in this one, if your uh, abilities slash spells max out, you can learn abilities that stay on you. For example, you learn like critical up, uh, finish... Uh, finishing combo plus, uh, HP plus, and stuff like that. Okay. So yeah, that's an another reason why some of the sequels and prequels are just a little bit better than most. Is because they have some of those things to help out. Although I hate these enemies. They're a bunch of bouncing roly poly -olies. Not only that, but if you attack their front, they'll get bigger. So you have to attack their back all the time. Kind of like a large body, but it's more that deadly. Yes, they're very explosive if you attack their front. Now I just have this part. You know how we was thinking of the large bodies? Uh, yeah. In the football uniforms. Now I'm just imagining large bodies, but using them as basketballs. <laughs> get them to as big, get them as big as possible when they attack the front, and when they go to dunk it in the in the back in the basket uh it will fizz like get in there you stupid ball <laughs> yeah, you see what i mean how they get bigger and then they just you can't do any damage to them until they blow up they do a massive damage if you Ooh, get close to that's them. actually pretty though <laughs> it's like tell us like yeah i know there's an explosion behind me but i don't care uh. There's Master Xehanort. What's Master Xehanort doing here? Pay no Maybe attention to an him. old man like me. <laughs> Ooh. Nice title. Yeah, it is nice, isn't it? Alright then. So let's go and follow him. Wait for me! Also, one other thing. What? Marlon's in this, but just for a brief second. How brief are we talking about? Oh! <laughs> Why can't I ever seem to remember this address exactly?
Um, that was too brief. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me, Your Holiness. Huh? I believe you dropped this book. <gasps> Pooh Bear! Yeah. Did I? He becomes one of the command board. Oh, uh, I'm very sad to say this isn't one of mine, but what a remarkable book it is. This unassuming volume seems to have the unusual effect of awakening one's innermost abilities. A book that makes people stronger? If it's all right, Your Elderness, might I have a closer look? The name is Merlin. I'm a powerful wizard, and I'll have you know a lot of wisdom comes with age. Anyway, as I said, the book is not mine, but I'd be happy to keep it here for you. Thank you, Merlin. So we get to go to po Pooh's world? Not really in Pooh's world, but we get the command board. Oh. It features Pooh. Well, okay. Fire! What was that? I meant to press... Uh. What the... I was about to say, like, is Pooh giving you powers of honey already? Yeah. See? Oh. That was... sudden. Yeah. And brief. Like I said. It's like Merlin gets his, like, 30 seconds of moments, and that's it. Wait, there's no choo choo. Where's the choo? Oh, there it is! I was to say, don't worry, the choo 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 be here. If it's not, then I'm gonna be upset. One out of five stars. <laughs> I mean, the gameplay's good, picture's good, it's solid, performance. There's no choo choo in Merlin's house. This thing makes Disney sad! <laughs> What the heck? Is there a transformer in here? Kind of. A naturally nice it's basically guy. three mini it's basically three mini cons transformed into one map. <laughs> it's sad that you can name that so quickly. The <laughs> day I'm just really mad at that point. <laughs> Take a look at this area. Ooh. Yeah, this is where level interactivity actually comes back to some degree. And I say some degree because sadly this is like the only level of interactivity that you actually do with. In the entire game or just in this world? Because I know in uh, Dwarf Woodlands in the Queen's Castle. Yeah. Yeah, basically in this game, yeah, or in this world, yeah, that's about the only other one. But it's more like a platformer type interactivity, as you will find out in just a sec. Level 16. Yeah, you may think I'm already overpowered right now, but here the you're, problem- You're not overpowered yet. Exactly, and plus when you get to level 40 or 50, it slows down from there. Like, extremely slows down. Kingdom Hearts 3 would be released by the time I get to level 100 if I tried. Has anyone actually attempted to do that? I'm sure some people have. It just takes forever to they level They have way up. too much time on their hands then. Thankfully there isn't a trophy requirement to get level 100. Oh gosh. Whee! See what I mean? I'm not gonna climb the tiniest stuff. Is that an hourglass? Yes, it is. Why is there an hourglass in my kingdom hearts? When I see an hourglass, I'm expecting death from a bunch of enemies. Well, the bad thing is, if that hourglass manages to stay, it has a chance to freeze in you. In time. Yeah. 
Seriously, every single time I see a new spawn of enemy that shows up after I've previously killed the previous spawn, it makes me think to myself that they're getting closer and closer to make a Dynasty Warrior type Kingdom Hearts game. And I'm hoping that they plan to do that after Kingdom Hearts 3. Please, Square Ennis, make a Kingdom Hearts Warriors! Kingdom Warriors? Or Kingdom Hearts Keyblade Masters? I don't know. Keyblade Warriors? I guess, that had a better ring than my original attention. Keyblade Warriors, canon for 2019. Well, what the? I forgot about that one. Yeah, those things right there are actually pretty annoying. What the shit? What is that? A plant? Basically, yeah. Oh! There's a weed! It's supposed to be a carrot, I suppose. Because it's like orange body and it has a green top. No, not the bird. Why is it always the birds? You're done. Take that. You're done. Take that. You're done. Take that. I was about to that say that was actually hurt. a good time, and you you didn't even get blued up. Yeah, I was gonna say that's gonna hurt once that lands. Oh, now I remember these are the confusion. I hate being confused. Cause then backwards is forwards and forwards is backwards and up and down and left. Cats and dogs living together, mass hysteria. Yeah, what he said. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, it's you're already at the boss. Well, yeah. that thingy that I put around earlier. Mm -hmm. Although, why am I thinking this is some sort of, uh, oh yeah, cause Aqua and, uh, Ben. 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 Terra. Aqua. Yes. Told ya. Oh yeah, it's cute. It's trying to be like the god armor from Kingdom Hearts 1, but not. Tries to, yeah. Yes, the, destroy the, it. The, the, there is no denying it. It tries to be like the guard armor, but it, it does okay, but it doesn't really outdo the guard armor. Yes, kill this imposter! If I can hold the. Oh, there it goes! Yes, information, Bob! We get it! Shut up! Okay, yeah, he's mad a lot. We already killed one! I think I'm butt raping it. I am unleashing my lasers! Oh. 
you're just exterminating this thing. When I say destroy this imposter, I didn't mean literally. <laughs> Leon's like, you just killed it! I just wanted to be a good robot! <laughs> you know, you just exterminate the poor sucker. <laughs> what do you do? St drop your ice cream? <laughs> Tara! Then, now, come on! Nicely done. <laughs> I just want to do the next robot wars. We make a good team. Sure do. Oh yeah, I got you these tickets. For what? Lifetime passes to Disney Town. What the heck is he a Disney? He said to take two grown-ups. <laughs> <laughs> you mean us? <laughs> well, they're older than him. Yeah. Listen to me, then. We need to get you home. It's okay, Aqua. Trust me, that guy in the mask is history. I'll never badmouth Terra again. <laughs> you saw the boy in the mask? Uh, uh y yes? Venetus. Ven, you let Aqua take you home. No way! I want to go with you guys. You can't. We have a dangerous task ahead of us. I don't want you to get hurt. And what is this dangerous task, Tara? It doesn't sound like what the Master told you to do. It might be a different route, but I'm fighting the darkness. I'm not so sure. I've been to the same worlds as you, and I've seen what you've done. You shouldn't put yourself so close to the darkness. Oh. Listen to yourself, Aqua. Tara would never- You mean you've been spying on me? Is that what he said to do? The Master's orders? He was only... Aqua? I get it. Terra! Just stay put! <laughs> I'm on my own now, alright? Terra, please, listen! The Master has no reason to distrust you, really! He was just worried! Oh dear. Yeah. This is where things start to go a little bit down sloped. Use your aggressive feelings, boy. Yet the hate flow with. Oh, wait, we're going to Disney! Yeah! You must be Tara. It's that old coot. He won't stop asking for you. I came all the way out here to get you just so he'd clam up. Hello? What do you mean? Ha! Do I have to spell it out? Xehanort, whatever he's called. You know, my prisoner. <laughs> You're apparently not a very good liar. Master Xehanort would never let himself be caught by a thug like you. As if. I got the old coot at my mercy. See for yourself. I'm holding him underneath the outer gardens. You better show up before I lose my patience. Ciao. But you're right There's here, dude. No, no, you're no right. What? <laughs> they almost like, but he's right here. We can take him out easy, like we did with that previous boss. <laughs> you just killed his. What if that robot actually had a part-time job? You know, what if he had to go and, you know, vacuum castles and repair. TV cables or something. Really what about awesome. his family? What's his family fix of it? I'm asking way too philosophical questions about this, aren't I? Yeah, you are. I'm almost about ready to level up again. Oh crap, not this crap again. Oh! He went completely!
So I take it the Outer Gardens is that way. Yep, it is. Yay! Oh, hi, stranger! If only I could turn around and do something. Yeah. It's a good thing that he's not fast enough to turn around, or otherwise that would be a pain. Wow, that's a very short area. <laughs> it's meant to be a safe point. Ooh, now that's cool, actually. Like I said, this area is very nice. Why did the love of Patrick come and screw everything up? Because she's the uh, mistress of all evil. But this place is beautiful. You look at it. I mean, granted, Hollow Bastion in the first game is pretty as well, but this stuff is paradise. <laughs> Daniel just can't get over how good Radiant Garden used to be. You know, since I'm playing on Ashley Star and Garden in the spring, I think I'm gonna do something like this. Out of waterfall. That's a bit excessive for a park, uh, for a uh, apartment complex. Wouldn't you think? It can happen. A waterfall feature? Well, not those big ones, you know, get like, you know, those tiny waterfall things. I don't know if you remember, but do you remember uh, that one uh, water feature that Lowe's had years ago where it was like a lion head? I vaguely remember. I actually wouldn't mind having something like that. That would actually be pretty cool. I was thinking of like also the water feature that uh, Mom has on her fun yard. Oh, that. Okay. Yeah. I see I'm, not, I'm not asking for us to make a big waterfall or anything, you know? Right. Also, just because uh, there's a. In Breath of the Wild, there's one uh, trial that's like located where there's a bunch of flowers across. And if you walk on the flowers, this lady will get fierce. It's like, get out of here! You're walking on the flowers! So now I'm just imagining her showing up as you're walking on those flowers. <laughs> oh, that is funny. And then here we go. I remember having to deal with this one pretty difficultly. Well, you got on Prowl, don't you? Well, yeah. But, I'm just wondering how well this will work out. Because it, 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 it got difficult. <laughs> Real quickly. Because I was assuming this would be the same fight as before since I recognized him. But no, it's a bit different, to some degree. I say a bit because he's a little OP. You know, for suicide, this is actually not bad. Master Xehanort! The old coot certainly knows how to take punishment. Just I... like I know how to deal it out. I took old town for like three hours and he still won't say anything. That thing right there, it's called the Keyblade, isn't it? Yeah, seems like these days everybody's got one of those. Even Grandpa there. When I nabbed him, he told me all about it. What a weapon like that can do. How could I not want one? But you'll find they're picky about their owners. Huh. 
If I heard the old guy right, you're what they call Keyblade Master Material. So if I defeat you, that makes me the real Keyslinger. If you catch my drift. Not the most polite way to go about it. But what can you do? Uh, uh, one more step and the coot goes boom. You think I'm gonna fight fair? As if. That key's too powerful for us to go mano a mano. <laughs> <laughs> go honky. <laughs> for a keyblade master, you're not very... What's the word? Good? <laughs> what are you doing, Tara? Fight! But master, you'll... Never mind me! You must fight! You can't let this ruffian win! Think of your master, Ericus! The shame he and your fellow pupils will be forced to bear! Use the keyblade! Oh dear, there's an earthquake. So much for the bluff. <laughs> and this music is really good. Yes, we get an information bomb, right? Yeah. Oh, that's why I forgot the whole Zig boys. I keep on calling that, but I know that's not his name. Uh. Before he turns into nobody. Okay, we are back to this again. Ow. I can see you. I can see you. That wasn't too bad, actually. You just gotta be extra careful. He can be difficult if you're not careful. And he said find the keyblade as a mono a mono. <laughs> He's such a liar.
Holy! <laughs> it was like a kangaroo! Well done, Tara. <laughs> You have taken yet another step forward. No, no, I'm, I can't I use it to what you're saying. I'm, I'm too... <laughs> you okay? <laughs> it was like a... His shoes are pogo sticks or something. <laughs> yeah, even I was like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> I mean, he could have just run, but just... <laughs> that was beautiful. That oh, got like... you really good, didn't it? <laughs> That was beautiful. I could cry. I was like, love it. And it could take it. Hatred. That was the power of darkness. The darkness that you channeled. No. I succumbed to it. Just like when I stole Princess Aurora's heart of light. What you did what? I can never return home now. Failure. Then don't. You could be my pupil. <laughs> Master Arrakis, you see, is so afraid of darkness that he too has succumbed. Not to darkness, but to light. It shines so bright, he forgets that light begets darkness. And Aqua and Ventus. Their lights shine too bright. It is only natural that they cast shadows on your heart. Erechus, you're such a fool. Light and darkness, they are a balance. One that must always be maintained. Terra, you are the one who shows the true mark of mastery, but he refuses to see it. Because he fears you. Join me. You and I can do the world's much greater good by wielding light and darkness in equal shares. Master Zeno. See more worlds. Seek out the darkness that upsets the balance. Find Vanitas and bring an end to him. Master Terra. No, you scared me. I gotta go use the powerful battle and run over those chains for like three hours. There, go and can't believe it. Run, 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 run. <laughs> Too similarity to Star Wars Episode 3? Nah, not enough lightning bolts. <laughs> Tara! Take me with you. I can't do that, Ben. Uh, why not? I just... When I really need you, Vin, I know you'll be there. <laughs> well, why wouldn't I? You're my friend. Yeah. You're right. Thanks, Vin. And this is where it gets funny. Funny? Just watch. Oh no, I'm not ready for it yet. Hey! You old coot! You said I wouldn't get hurt! I didn't sign up to be collateral damage! No way! As if! <laughs> Hi! Okay, okay, fine, fine. Just, just, just put that down. 
You still need me. You still need me to do something, right? And all I'm asking is that you hold up your end of the bargain. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what's a little scratch on my face, huh? All things considered. I'm just lucky you didn't steal my heart like Princess whatever it was. That would have ruined my week for sure. Unlikely. A powerful light still lives inside of Terra. You see, people like him, they don't have the power to steal hearts. So wait, you mean... He's not the one who stole her heart? <laughs> not willingly. Although, did his keyway had an eye on it? It gets revealed later on in the series. So, so Calibur Cafone for Kingdom Hearts? No, not oh. even close. Should I spoil that part for you? No. I'll okay. find out later. Ooh, Yuki Yuki! Yep. Ooh, Diddy Down! Diddy Down! <laughs> we will, I promise you, we will. In the next video, though. Okie dokie. That's fair. Alright then, guys. We'll see you in the next video where we'll go to Disney Town. Yeah! <laughs> we'll see you then. Till then, this is Blackrock and Delmar signing off. Goodbye. Take care, guys.